Hello, it's a special day. Guess what tomorrow is? Tomorrow is Thanksgiving. So I thought it would be nice if we had a special Thanksgiving story. So today's story is going to be Bear Says Thanks. All alone in his cave, Bear listens to the wind. He is bored. Bored, bored. And he misses his friends. Aw, he's sad. Poor Bear. I could make a big dinner, a feast I could share. But he looks through his cupboard and the cupboard is bare. Oh, he wanted to make a big meal for all of his friends and he went to look for food, but he didn't have any. Then Mouse stops by with a huckleberry pie. And the bear says, thanks. Oh, look, there's Mouse bringing a pie and Bear is so happy. He said, thank you. Bear says, goodness me, a delectable pie. But I've made nothing, he adds with a sigh. He was so happy that his friend brought him a pie, but he felt bad because he didn't make anything for his friend. Then they hear, hi-ho, and they both see Hare with a big batch of muffins at the door of the lair. Look, Hare is showing up with a basket of muffins. Yummy, yummy. Hare hurries in from the cold, rushing wind, and the bear says, thanks. Oh, look, his friend brought some more treats, and he says, thanks. Of course, says Hare. Then he points to the door. Here comes Badger. He's got even more. Oh, look, Badger's coming to the door, too. And Badger has something. I wonder what Badger has. <laughs> Says Badger as he tromps inside. He gets down his pole and he smiles real wide. I'm back from a stroll at the old fishing hole. And the bear says, thanks. Badger brought a whole bunch of fish. Then Gopher and Mole tunnel up from the ground. We have warm honey nuts. We'll pass them around. Oh, look, he had friends pop up from the ground and they're going to pass around some honey nuts. Yum, yum. There's a flap and a flitter and a flurry in the den when in flutters Owl with Raven and Wren. Whoa, look, more friends are showing up. We have bears from the tree and herbs to brew tea. Oh, everybody's bringing lots of stuff to share. And the bear says, wait. I wonder why bear is saying wait. Bear mutters and he stutters and he wears a big frown. Bear sighs, and he moans, and he plops himself down. You have brought yummy treats. You are so nice to share. But me, I have nothing. My cupboards are bare. Oh, look at he's so sad. Everybody brought stuff, but he didn't have anything to share. Mouse squeaks. No fret! There's enough, dear bear. You don't need any food. You have stories to share. His friends hug him tight. It will be all right. And the bear says, thanks. Oh, so even though he didn't have food to share, they said he had stories he could share. They lay out their feast on a quilt on the ground. 
and the bear takes a seat while his friends gather round. So they're all going to sit on a blanket and they're going to all share their food. I wonder what bear is going to do. In a cave in the woods, in a warm, bright lair, the friends feel grateful for their good friend bear. They pass around platters, they tweet and they chatter. Oh, they're all talking and having a good time. They're so thankful for their friend bear. And they all say, thanks. They're so thankful for each other. The end. And I am very thankful for you. Happy Thanksgiving. I love you. Mwah.